Oh, hello. Today, we will try to have an experiment about Boyle's Law. But first, what is Boyle's Law, Valerie and Kago? The relationship between the volume and pressure of gases at constant temperature was first stated by Robert Boyle during the 16th century. He found out that as the pressure increases, the volume decreases. Boyle's Law states that the pressure and volume are inversely proportional, meaning at constant temperature, as the pressure increases, the volume decreases, and vice versa. Thank you for the chart explanation. But for this experiment, we need materials. And what do we need, Kego? The materials that you are going to need are balloon, water, straw, and two empty bottles. And their procedure will be explained by Ismael Tajali. Okay, the first thing we will do is fill up the balloon with air. Then when the balloon is filled with air, the next step is to put it on the bottle, filled with water. Make sure the balloon is put on the bottle securely. Remember to not let go of the balloon yet before starting the experiment. Now, as the air inside the balloon is released into the bottle filled with water, the pressure inside is increased, so the volume will decrease, meaning the water inside the bottle enters to the straw and thus transferring the water to the other bottle. As you can see from the experiment, the air of the balloon finds a way out inside of the bottle. While the pressure increases, the balloon becomes smaller. Because the bottle has an opening, it connects to the other bottle, then the air will flow to the other bottle. The water represents volume. As the pressure of the balloon goes into the first bottle, the water decreased. Meaning, as the pressure increased, the volume decreased. In the second bottle, as the pressure decreased, the volume increased. Because the pressure travels here from the first bottle. So that's our experiment for Boyle's Law. We hope you understand and thank you and goodbye. Yay, graduate na!